Well, I mean, I've played 11, I've played 10 holes so far. I think uh, obviously the front nine, uh, various holes are very difficult. The long are very, very long and the short are short. So, you know, you get your rest bites on those short holes and you kind of, you got to hang in there on them tough holes, play smart, try and make pars. If you've got an opportunity for birdie, see if you can nick it. If you, you know, if you can't make par, then just make bogey and get out of there and try and recover on those short holes, which give you the opportunities to make some birdies. I mean, of late, you know, last couple of months, I haven't been happy at all, but uh, I've, the good is really, really good. Uh, I need to manage the bad right now. And if, if I manage the bad very well, then I'm going to shoot some good scores. Um, no, I don't think so. I think no matter which US Open you play, it's, they pretty much set them up the same way. Whichever course you play, the rough's pretty thick, the fairways are narrow. They want level par to win. You know, it's how, the, it's how it is. No matter which course they play, it always seems to be the same. I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm obviously in a good moment and um, you never know what's going to happen at the beginning of the week. So uh, all you can do is just uh, is just go on, on the tee Thursday morning and try to do your best. And, uh, you know, I'm, because I'm in a confident moment right now, I can I can do my best. So uh, we'll see. We'll see really what's going to happen. It's hard to tell. Uh, I like this course, so I I, I definitely, I definitely can can perform well this week, but we'll see. We'll see what's going to happen. It's hard. To, it's hard, really hard to say when you've got such a great field and and so many strong guys that really want, really want to win this week.